Good morning children. Today we shall learn about the area of a circle. It's Aman's birthday today. Aman cut his birthday cake into 20 equal pieces for his friends. Look here. All the pieces are equal and look similar too. Now, if the cake was further cut into many small equal pieces, then the edges of each piece would almost look like a straight line instead of a curve. Now, if we keep all the pieces of the cake like this on a tray, then look, all the pieces are forming a rectangle. Now, if Aman had divided the cake further into more equal sized pieces, then this rectangle would have been more accurate. So here we see a rectangle. Now we can find the area of rectangle easily. Here the area is length multiplied by the breadth. When Aman cut the cake, the circumference of the circle or the cake got divided into 20 equal parts. Now in the tray, each side of the rectangle has half of the total number of pieces. So the length of one side is equal to half the circumference of the circle. Correct? And what about the breadth? Look carefully. The breadth is equal to the radius of the circle. Say R. So we see the area of this rectangle is equal to length multiplied by breadth which is equal to half the circumference multiplied by the radius of this cake. Now the circumference is equal to pi multiplied by the diameter or pi multiplied by 2 times the radius. So putting this value of circumference we get half multiplied by pi multiplied by d multiplied by r. Now d is equal to 2r. So half multiplied by pi multiplied by 2r multiplied by r. Now we can cancel 2 from both the numerator and the denominator. Thus we get the area which is equal to pi multiplied by r multiplied by r which is equal to pi r square and this is the area of rectangle. But remember we made this rectangle out of the circular cake. So we can say this is the area of the circular face of the cake too. So the area of circle is equal to pi r square. So remember children area of any circle is pi multiplied by radius square. The unit of area of square is square units always like square centimeter, square meter etc. And value of pi is 22 by 7 or 3.14 approximately. So now you know what is the area of a circle of a given radius. That's all for now. Bye bye children.